a group of people tell us their apartments are falling apart and they have the pictures to prove it. They most certainly do and it's hard to believe that nothing is being done about this issue. News 2's Macy McLeod shows us just how serious the problem is at this complex. Guys, we are talking about apartments that are in serious disrepair and mold so bad you can see right here there is a mushroom growing out of the floor. Just take a look at that. Look at that picture there. It's crazy. This is at Harbor Point Apartments in Mount Pleasant. Well, the people I talked to today are worried about retaliation, so we've altered their voices. You and the big bad wolf, you could probably blow very hard and the building would, would fall down. People tell me the apartments are falling apart. I can't even go out on my patio because it's rotted. Appliances aren't getting repaired. My air conditioner has been broken since September. It has been anywhere between 80 and 90 degrees here. I've had to sleep in my car. I've had to sleep over at friends' houses. Even though it is repeatedly reported to the office. They're saying that everything was corrected and fine, but it's not. And they say there are leaks, letting in water that is breeding mold. The electrical outlets are shorting out because there's so much water in the walls. There are other people that have mold on their floors, under their floors, growing up their walls, on their ceilings. Causing health problems that doctors believe are mold related. I have bronchitis for the second time since August. I just got diagnosed with adult onset asthma. They're doing blood work to see if there's black mold spores in my blood right now. And even though these problems aren't being solved. Why don't you just move? Why not just stick it out and deal with it till the end of your lease and get out? There is an affordable housing shortage. It's not so easy to find a place to live or I would have been out of here. And one of those people I spoke to today is planning to hire an attorney and has had a building inspector come to the complex to log those problems. I also reached out to the apartment complex both locally and at their corporate office. Both promised to call me back, but I never got one. All right, Macy, tough to look at the situations in those apartments. Mm -hmm. If anyone else is going through a similar issue at their apartment uh, complex, what should they do? Well, I did call the town of Mount Pleasant and ask them what they recommend, and they say the first step is to call code enforcement and file a complaint with them, and then they'll take it from there. So I have posted the phone number to code enforcement. It's through the town of Mount Pleasant's main line, and you can find that online at countonto.com. Yeah, very difficult situation. We certainly hope things work out, and we will continue to watch and update our viewers as to what happens.